Good morning, beautiful humans. Today, we are going to do a lot of things, but we are starting our day off here at Fire Island, the rustic bakery here, and grab some breakfast. Point out, macaroon is this. Macaron is the French cookie. Very different thing. We picked up Fire Island for breakfast. So we made it to the Alaska Wildlife Conservation Center and the moose is up and I have my nice camera so hopefully I can get some good photos and it is beautiful out here guys. So pretty. And it's a little chilly. <laughs> Hi beautiful. Hi. So we have come by the bear um, exhibit and we didn't think anyone would be out. But look, look at that guy. He's digging a hole, but he got really tired about it. We were sitting here watching the sleeping bear and this guy came up and he wanted some hay and I think he's gonna lay down, get some rest. You smell something? Good job. You gonna take a nap? Give it up. Face down. And this one gave up on his hole. And this one's about to take like a just plop down and take a nap. You tired? It's that time of year to the uh, reindeer slash caribou um, area and they just got fed. But look how beautiful. Look at this guy. Go get your food. those antlers. They're all lined up over there. <laughs> Hi Gorge. So pretty. Oh posing for me. Thank you. So this is a uh, different area of the caribou, which is mainly females and the babies. And this guy got his own meal. All the, all the babies get their own little plates. There's a bunch of female back there. And there's some females and they're getting some water. Squirrel, ground squirrels, one of the species of marmot. And tree frogs technically don't really hibernate, they brumate, they freeze mm -hmm. themselves for the winter. So oh, that does it for us here at the Alaska Conservation Center. It was so much fun, beautiful, saw a bunch of animals and support local business. We pulled off on the side of the road because we saw this and uh, we just had to stop and take a picture of it. It's crazy. What? This is beautiful. Oh my God. You can see the fog moving on the water. It's so beautiful. Look at this. What is happening? <laughs> We found Narnia, you guys. This is crazy. Here today. <laughs> uh. Whoa. Just remember when Corey Williams, uh, Mr. Safety, dude like hella, first moved to Just Alaska. <laughs> His first viral video in, Ala video in Alaska was at a lake when the lake was just starting to freeze. He threw a rock on it and it made laser sounds and he like lost his mind. So, 
I think we're gonna see that happen right now. Listen closely. <laughs> I need a bigger rock. <laughs> there's one right here. Wait, there's a That didn't work so well. Guys, we have made it to Seward for the Sea Life Center. And look, I mean, what? Um, it, the fog has lifted, thankfully. It is nice and sunny, beautiful. Um, but when it's nice and sunny, it gets a little colder because there's nothing holding in the heat. And man, look at like, what? This is crazy. So beautiful. I'm very confused on how this is a thing. What? We have made it into the Sea Center and masks are required in here. And uh, they remind you when you pick up your tickets that it is over your nose and mouth, which I appreciate. So we're going to check out everything here. So this map shows the commercially harvested seafood of Alaska and all the different types of fish and crabs and things like that. beautiful starfish right here. It's like pink and white. This tank is full of gorgeous fish. Okay. This guy is so pretty. This is one of the sea lions and I wanted to film him because my favorite dude, Jackson, loves sea lions. So I wanted to film that for him. See if he pops back up. Oh, there he is. There's a bunch of starfish in this tank. And look at this guy. There's like some firmness to him. This guy's just let himself go. This is my favorite part of the whole affair. It's really bright, but there is a beautiful, beautiful. He's drinking some water. <gasps> Back in the water. Swimming around. So what I just showed you was a seal. And this guy over here is a sea lion. The difference is sea lions have ear flaps and seals have just ear holes. So that is the difference there. And there he is again. Hi, bud. Hi. Hey, buddy. How you doing? Beautiful. He came to say hello. So cool. The sea lion is just swimming around. And he just like climbed up on his rock. Like what? never seen him do that. He's posing. Thanks. Not quite great. Nice whiskers. So here's the Sea Life Center. We just walked out on this observation deck. And, uh, uh-huh, yep, yep, mm -hmm. totally fine. The 
this is actually the bottom of the aviary. And if you look up uh, really closely, you can see little feetsies. Little bird feet. She's trying to pull me into the camera. Oh These animals are strong mm -hmm. and smart. Okay. Um, so we came into the section of the aquarium and it says this was created by students at Kodiak High School using debris from a coastal cleanup and they made an octopus out of it. But guys, they made an entire octopus out of just trash. Be mindful, guys, of your waist. All right, that does it for us at the Sea Life Center. It was so cool seeing these amazing things. Auburn's hugging trees, I think. Um, and I'm gonna go grab my camera because I gotta take some high quality res photos of this amazing, amazing spot. So I'm gonna go grab my camera. And uh, if you don't follow me on Instagram, follow me on Instagram. The link is in the description below because I will be posting these photos and it is going to be amazing. So we are hungry, so we're going to go to a place called the Highliner here in Seward to grab some lunch and fuel back up because after this, I think we're going to go to Byron Glacier and then the day is still young. It's only lunchtime. We've done so much. So let's get some food. finished a highlighter. I had a French dip and it was one of the best I've ever had in my entire life. It was so good. I took some of it home so I'll have leftovers for later. And now we're going to Resurrection Coffee. Is that what it's called? Resurrection Coffee House and Gallery. And I said, I don't care if we go because I don't like coffee. But Auburn asked, do you like churches? And I said, sure. This is the coffee house. It's just an old church that they converted. You can tell that this used to be a church. Well, it's a coffee shop and uh, they have they feature like local artists and their art and fun and things like that Actually, for uh, for went uh, Byron Glacier, and we decided to come home, pick up Sherry. We went to something very disappointing that I don't want to talk about because I'm still angry about it. But don't do things sometimes that are offered to you. And then um, we went to Cars, which is a grocery store, and we picked up pumpkins and we carved pumpkins. So I was just gonna show you that Sherry carved a beautiful castle. Look at that. With a, firework that you can't With a firework that you can't really see. It's fine. <laughs> She'll work on it. Adam carved Baymax. I mean, easiest thing ever. And perfect for Adam. Auburn is in a beautiful shirt. Look at that. Ready? And boo! boo! She carved a little kitty. And then I did a self portrait. You're welcome. Here I am again, editing Mackenzie. Welcome back to this, this is a new segment apparently in my vlogs because I cannot finish anything. Um, this was a really fun day and probably my favorite day because I got to see so much of outside the city. So we started our day super early, it was kind of dark still. We went to Fire Island for breakfast. I got a ham and Swiss croissant. It was so buttery, so flaky, absolutely delicious. Uh, and then we headed um, to the conservation center which Auburn has been talking up and Adam has been talking up so much that um, we spent a lot of time there, walked around, saw beautiful animals that they are rehabilitating and kind of making sure that Alaska preserves that wildlife um, and taking care of them and putting effort into making sure that those species are here to stay and rehabilitated if they are hurt and everything like that. So it was super cool to see that. Then we went uh, to Seward, which is a beautiful, beautiful town. We went to the Sea Life Center, which is also almost the same as the conservation center. They um, do a rehabilitation if they find animals. They kind of make more of them, like if they need to, like they repopulate um, if they need to, and they also rehabilitate and release um, seals, sea lions, all that stuff back into the wild if they are hurt or if they have been abandoned. And it's a really cool place. Uh, we went to Highliner for lunch, which is kind of 
off the beaten path in a way like it's not very talked up which it should be because the service was amazing the um queso that we had for the appetizer was almost like a mac and cheese queso it was very interesting delicious the chips were perfect and then we had i had a french dip for lunch and it was perfect and another thing i noticed and adam and i were talking about this is that in alaska they have um a lot of horseradish uh, cream sauce on their french dips it's like come standard which i find a, maybe a little odd um i don't know if I've, i mean i've eaten a good amount of french dips and that's never been a thing so i don't know if it's an alaska thing and we were just talking about it and being like i don't know so if it is let me know in the comments down below um and then we end the night um, with carving pumpkins and just having a good time so i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give it a thumbs up make sure to subscribe to this channel if you have not already and turn on that bell notification so you're notified every single time i post a video which is every monday wednesday and friday and until next time guys be beautiful humans bye want to subscribe click or tap right here want more alaska click or tap right here Want more of the adventure? Click or tap right here.